Alrighty guys and gals, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the Misty Mountain Gaming Channel. I'm Big E. Happy Friday to you. It is Fright Night Weekend once again, and we are back in Outlast. Second game. The DLC is called The Whistleblower. This is a prelude to what happened in the first game. Anyway, let's continue here. Uh, no webcam today. I've changed my studio around. That's right. We are down here. Uh, anyway, don't have the green screen on. Probably be a little bit more immersive. Hopefully it will. Look at this creepy stuff floating, floating around here. Looks like we're in an old workshop. I hear some creepy old music. Looking for batteries. Getting a Jeepers Creepers vibe. What is going on in here? Okay, let's read this note. What fresh hell. A man's body mutilated and bent to mimic or mock the moment of birth. The kind of thing a man cannot see without changing in some irreparable way. Lisa, I was with you when both our boys were born. It was until recently the most miraculous thing I had seen. Completely outside of reasonable belief and yet somehow central to everything I've come to believe since. You always said I was too literal-minded, tried to turn everything into an if-then statement. But lately I've widened my horizons. How can the things I've seen here be? But I know the answer. Money and profit. Things we made just because we could. I don't know if I'd have the presence of mind to be making, uh, like, diary entries. the actual oh my god wow definitely the Jeepers Creepers 5 if you guys have never seen a movie called Jeepers Creepers now I'm talking about the first one I'm not talking about any of the other ones the first one it's it's, it's not too bad if you're into horror. Welcome home. Kind of wish I could turn that off.
that freak gonna come back this way? Boy, I am not liking this, man. Think the webcam is not on? Did I frighten you? Oh. Oh my god. Did he not see me? Wow. I about had a heart attack back there. That's this whole game. Did that just go in a circle there? It does. Okay. Oh. So this is where he was standing, was right here. going on in here, man. Oh. Push it. Push it. Get me in there. Open it. I don't know where I'm going. Did we just go in a big circle? Okay. I mi I probably missed a bunch of stuff. Oh no!
Oh. 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 What do I? I can't do any. Oh, here. in there. Oh my god. Uh, what do I do? Could use some visine, bro. Here we go. What are, what are you doing? No? What the hell? I've been a little vulgar. And I want to say I'm sorry. I just... You know how a man gets what he wants to know. But after the ceremony... What is the hell is he doing? You, I promise, I'll be a different man. We're just being pulled, I see. We're on our back being pulled. I want a family, a legacy, to be the father I never had. I'll never let anything happen to our children. Not like... I can't do anything here. I have to wait here. I know you must be. Oh to no! Concentrate our love. We we'll try to enjoy the anticipation. Here, darling. What's up? Help you with that. Where in the hell are we at in relation to the to the institute? I don't want to see it. Get me the hell out of here. Hello? Oh. Darling, I need you to try to bleed less. I know no, the fair no, sex no, often endure no, the same no, wounds with your suffering, but you really need to make an effort. Oh, 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 get me the fuck out of here, bro. No, I'm so sorry, darling. Love. Like, I, I go out of the locker, put him in a chokehold. There's another guy on a table back there. This game, the gore in this game is yikes. Hold still now, darling. All these unsightly hairs. Oh, silky smooth. Oh, like little girl again. What the? More delicate bits. I don't want to watch. No. Uh -huh. Oh God! You've given up. You're ugly. You've given up. Oh, no. You're not even worth stringing up. Oh God! Please. What are they fucking making us watch this for, bro?
Oh! You have amazing bone structure. Such soft skin. You're going to be beautiful. I'm gonna can murder you. Come on. Break it. Break it. to suffer some things. It's not pleasant, I know. But just try to endure. For my sake. Do you see my penis? Of our children. Get me the fuck out of here, bro. It won't take long. A few snips of the flesh here and here. Cut away everything vulgar. A soft place to welcome my seed. To grow our family. The incision will hurt. Oh and the my god! The birthing is never easy. I'll make the cut fast. Just close your eyes. Dude! Dude! Oh! Fucking... Who is this dude? Oh! Yeah, like I'd go for the camcorder. Oh. Where the hell are we going, man? Oh. Oh, I went the wrong way. Uh. Oh, my batteries! Fuck, my batteries! I'm out of batteries, dude! Oh my god, I don't know where to go. Can I get out here? Are you serious? I'm trying to teach it, Robert. Nothing over here. Can I get up there? Uh, we're, good. we're just we're gonna die in here. We're just I can't get away from this guy. Oh, Dude, you bet your ass I would be running faster than this. Oh no. Come on. Go. Oh. This guy can't run very fast either, apparently. Just jump. Just jump. Oh my god. How dare you? I'm not easy. Dude, I have no batteries. Oh, I do have a battery. Oh, what is my effing objective? Exit via the administration block. That door's open. Yeah, sure, let's read a document. That seems helpful. Oh. Project Wall Rider patient status report for Eddie Gluskin. Patient Eddie Gluskin. 6'9", 2013, age 46, male, observing physician, Dr. Garrett Snow. Therapy status, lucid dreaming, figures remain as murky as ever. Gluskin claims near constant control of his dream state, yet correspondence between his narrative and REM cycles. Uh, good reading. Highly arrhythmic REM, non-REM, morphogenic engine activity, plateaus at 90 ppm. Diagnostics, heavy bronchial bronchial accumulation. The rashes, the rashes associated with hormone therapy have... 
receded and vanished since we stopped using latex tubing. Gluskin remains a frustrating interview subject. He's still trying to tell us what he thinks we want to hear. While studiously avoiding certain elements of the truth, his childhood remains an obvious fiction. He's claiming to have grown up in Leave It to Beaver, despite a traumatically violent ongoing sexual experience that is a matter of public and medical record. When I confronted him with this photograph, so this is the guy that was just trying to kill us. With photographs his father and uncle took, he responded with a mixture of laughter and anger and restraints were issued. He similarly refused to discuss his victims, both categorically and specifically. When I showed him pictures of the women, he would not admit that they were dead or mutilated. He is claiming advanced, he is claiming advancement in the morphogenic engine program that he has not yet achieved. Said that he could clearly hear the voice of the wall rider just by closing his eyes. Clearly, he's still trying to curry the favor of his doctors. I won't speculate at what he expects to gain by it. We're going to be hunting batteries. Oh, I've got a... Let's just do that. Oh my god, dude. That's the elevator shaft. Battery. Chained. I feel kind of bad for this guy. It's like broken ankle. Who knows what else? The store needs a key. Of course it does. What do we have here? Emergency evacuation. Is this going to help me in any way? Okay, we are there. I don't know how that helps me. Find the key to access the mail ward. How about a key to get the fuck out of here? Battery. Oh my god. It's all bodies hanging. Bluebeard's wives? Bodies hanging like wet laundry, like skinned rabbits. Men mutilated, hunted, and murdered. The shortest distance between any two points separates violence and ruined lust. I'm not sure how that saying goes. That's not how it goes. Whatever story he's telling himself, he's not making women to bear his children. He's making women to kill them. Lisa, I want you to burn this place and any evidence it ever existed to the ground. Destroy the Murkoff Corporation. Bury it in shame. Take away its money. Wipe it from history. This man think, thinks he's in love. He thinks the therapy made him better. Everything reeks of death and fear. Piss and coppery blood. Meat decomposing to game. Hey, coffee. Open these. No. Yeah, we are seriously messed up. There's some feet hanging out of there. Oh, no. 
I don't want to go in. This is a gymnasium. This is like the scene from The Sixth Sense. Well, that this is uh, quite a bit gorier. Yeah, he's made all these men uh, into quote-unquote women. How did we get back near this guy? Run this way. Man, I am real lost. Like, I don't know where in the, the hell we are in space and time. Okay, no reason to come in here. It's just a place to hide. Before I take that key, definitely go this way. Well, I'm going to move this first. Open that. Is he coming? Oh, 
Dude! Why does I keep doing that? Oh no! He fucking duped me, bro! Oh my... Why is there... Okay. Okay. I think they were bugged out. There were two of them. So I can't, like, prep. I've got to grab the key and go. We have to get back through the gymnasium. I guess that's what we do. Go, go, go. God, it takes forever to push those things. Can I get out? He's like right behind me. What am I supposed to do, bro? Go, please go, please go, go, go. No way, man! Are you fucking serious? I can't run. Oh my god. Ah, <laughs> okay. I mean, I can't do this any faster, I don't think. And I can't do this first because he just comes around. Oh, I just go straight through. Come on. Please, please, please. This is as fast as my dude runs. Come on, get up, get up. Yes! You later, freak! As Scandal would say, goodbye to you. Oh, dude. Oh. Let's get to the door. Let's get the hell out of here. How do I... Here. Get me the hell out of here. something here? It's breaking. Hold still. God damn it, what are you? Oh, damn it, darling. No, you need to behave. We could have been beautiful. What in the actual hell is happening, man? Oh, so sorry about that. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Oh my god, dude. Die! Wow, man. Oh.
we gonna make it this time? Go ahead and close that. Wow. Got a save point here. What is happening out there, man? Burning church. A chapel on fire in the distance. I didn't even know we had a church. Where's God? Would you need him? Hey. Yeah. What kind of sick fuck would do this to somebody? Hey. He even took his damn pants. Open the door. I've seen more than enough dick and balls tonight to last me a lifetime. And not all of them attached to a man. Let's wrap this up. Uh, and get that hey, truck. hey over here. Are these guys coming for me? Serve and protect. Corporate cops, mercenaries, private military contract, or whatever they call them now, they're as helpless as the rest of us. Need to get out. Escape. Yeah, yeah. That would have been the first note. That I made. Huh. Beyond hope. Subject Rudolph Warnicky. Dear sirs, the groundwork has been laid to ensure an eventful and uneventful egress from Rudolf Warnicke from structural and financial systems at Mount Massive. His advanced age should alleviate any suspicious suspicions among contractors and employees, among whom he has been cheerfully nicknamed the Crypt Keeper. Nice. And legally speaking, he died years ago. I understood. I understand patients. One, two, and three. I've already been scheduled for transit. We're all terribly excited at all the obvious profit potential of the new project, my researchers have combed through Warnicke's files and found no mention of the three lucid dreamers. I think we can safely assume Warnicke was sufficiently distracted by the partial success of patient Billy Hope, along with his own infirmity, to be ignorant of the real discovery at hand. Even minimal exploitation of these resources is hard to overestimate. I only hope the new facility is sufficiently shielded to allow female staff so I can see what comes with my own eyes. Respectfully, Helen Grant. Legal Mitigation Department. I want out of here, man. I want out of here, bro. This looks familiar. This is, this is where we duped the big dude. 
This is how we got in. That's the way out right there. What is my objective? Find the key to access the mail. Ward, Ward already did that, bro. First jump scare. Oh, this is all bolted now. Can't get up there. Where the hell do we go here? Can't get out this way. Do I go downstairs? It's the only way we can go. Well, let's see what's on this side. No, I have to go downstairs. Great. Mr. Paul. Oh. It's this douche. Dude. No one can know. Fight no one. to the death. There you go. Get some of that. Oh. I think he died a little too quickly for my liking. The wall rider, man. Is this guy gonna... Is this guy dead too? Oh. Goodbye. Yes, there's my car. Get in my Jeep. Yes. Yes. Get the hell in there. Press that button. It's no going back, Mr. Park. There's enough hard evidence in that video file to make a world of shit for our friends at Murkoff. You got out of Mount Massive alive, and we've done everything in our power to cover your tracks. But our enemies are twitching and malicious corporate paranoiacs with resources you're too moral to imagine. You won't be the only target. Anyone you care about, your wife, your child, they'll do nothing to Murkoff but ways to hurt you. I need you to understand the bridge you're crossing here. You will do irrevocable damage to the company. You might even get close to something like justice. But once you click upload, your life is over. Everyone you love is fucked. But it's the right thing to do. Is hurting Murkoff worth that much to you? Yeah. Press the button. Upload that shit. Interesting. <laughs> 
Interesting. I don't know who that guy was. And why was he letting us send an email to ruin the company? Questions, so many questions. So there's another part to this game, I suppose. Uh, I don't know what part three is called, but I feel like we need to play it. I'm really getting into this. Anyway, I might put a poll out on the channel, uh, seeing if uh, what we're going to do next. I also got recommended a game called Soma, which I've heard of but never played. I watched some uh, clips of it on Steam. It looks really good. Um, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see where we go. Maybe we'll continue with Outlast here. But we will make a decision before... I don't know if we can do it before Sunday. I've got nothing to uh, to release on Sunday. I might uh, put the poll out, and then maybe we'll start a fresh... We'll start something fresh uh, next weekend. Anyway, I'm going to let the credits roll in case something cool happens. You guys and gals take care. I will see you... Either Sunday night or next Friday. Peace. Boom, boomy. On-site senior? I should say Big E. Not sure if I'd want that title. Resident old man? Hell of a game. A lot of French involved in this. Is that where it was made? I don't know. Is anything cool going to happen? No, it's not. Alrighty, guys and gals. Peace.